bring me my dog back. Only on two, a cry to get her pet back home. A Tulsa woman says a neighbor stole her dog and doesn't plan on returning him. Robin Ray tells us she rescued the stray from the frigid single digit temperatures. But two works for you reporter Travis Guillory spoke to that man and learned why he says it's for the best. I don't know these people. They just took my dog. Robin Ray claims her dog, this young Australian Shepherd, was taken near her yard. They assumed he was homeless and decided to do something with him. For the past four months, the dog would roam around this neighborhood, neighbors feeding it, giving it shelter, until Ray decided she would take the dog in permanently. It got cold. I took him in. He was in my home three or four nights. She says she let him out to use the bathroom Saturday. Then he was gone. All that was left, Royce Ellington's business Royce card. Ellington. So I called him. I asked him to bring the dog back. He said that he would. I asked her if she had papers on the dog. No. Asked her if she had a license for the dog. No. Asked her if she took the dog to the vet. No. It's just a neighborhood dog. Ellington says he and his wife, who live a block away, concerned about the dog, knocked on doors, asking if anyone knew who the owner was. They say neighbors said it was a stray. They didn't knock on my door. I'm right here. I don't work. I'm disabled. I'm retired. Most people in the, would believe that the dog should be in a good home, not roaming in the middle of the street. That's why Ellington gave the dog to his disabled brother in Collinsville. Everything's fine. The dog's happy. Brother's happy. But Ray is not happy and says she's still the dog's rightful owner. What he did was wrong. You shouldn't go into anyone's neighborhood and remove their pets when you don't know whose they are. That dog was took care of. But no matter who the dog ends up with, everyone can agree on one thing. If the dog's not roaming the street in the cold and looking for food and shelter. That's the main thing. In Tulsa, Travis Guillory, two works for you. Ray says she went to police, but they couldn't do anything because Ray could not prove that she was the dog's owner.